that something's off The way you look and how you pause When you talk, I think you said enough You said you love for me something brand new You said this is something you would never do Here we are in your car Let me see who you are Who you really are So yun, nandito kami ngayon sa uh, CF Open Road So meron kaming kinuhang RV uh, Pang negosyo na rin at pang gamit So yan, sineset up na lang yung ano Sineset up yung, yung hitch Kasi kasama yung hitch na yun So lalagyan na lang uh, equalizer Para mahila yung itong RV Then kasi kailangan i-level kasi yung hitch Dahil uh, Medyo mataas kasi yung tindig ng uh, pickup truck So yun, double axle 27 feet So 27 feet yung so, uh, yun, uh, Dito ko kasi kinuha yung ano, Yung ganito ko, yung ATV kong ginagamit sa bahay uh, Pinangpaplaw ko ng snow So binigyan nila ako ng magandang deal Zero down, then 6 months no payment So kaya kami nakakuha nitong RV So Pinasak namin siya sa pang business, uh, rental. So, yun, mag-start pa lang kami magparent nitong uh, RV na to. So, yan. So, yun, uh, set up lang, then go. Kaya, yeah, iuwi na namin siya sa bahay. Ang haba siya, 27 feet. So, ang bigat niya is 40. 4,000 ano? 4,000 pounds dry weight So mamaya papakita namin sa inyo kung ano itsura sa loob Kasi kailangan, kailangan mo nang iset up yung hitch Bago pumasok sa loob So yun, pakita namin sa inyo mamaya Hi. Taking video, it. You're videotaping me. Yeah. <laughs> Make sure you get my good side. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I want to. Yeah, want to look good I, on the video. I have. I have my YouTube channel. Oh, you do, so, dude. Yeah. So, to to tour na namin kay dito sa loob ng RV na kailuhan namin. So unexpected kasi wala kasi kami kaplan na plano kung ano ang RV. So yun. So yan, start, start kami dito sa labas. Medyo ano lang siya, still rim. Pero pagka kumita, eh, palitan natin yan. Cable antenna. Ito, plug in. Oh, may saksakang para sa labas. Hmm, check. Lagi check. Mabili yung torque wrench. Ayun, switch ng ilaw. Ayo. Ini switch yang ilau. This one. Ini. This is light. Siapa ni? Oh, ya. Ah, tak. Okay. Oh, okay. So, ini yang master 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 bedroom 
Ayan, masak sa nga doon. Ayan yung loob na. Okay. That one. Just got to have the power in for everything else. Okay, so you have your, once your power is all hooked up, this is just on battery power right now. Mm -hmm. So it's going to be a little bit different than when you have constant power. Just mm -hmm. on battery power, the only thing... Is it thing... full? Sorry, what? This is just to check the battery, right? Battery life. I right, mean... so that's just battery. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that's battery. That's your fresh water tank, right? Flash? That's oh, your black. Yeah, fresh. Uh, this is your black water tank, right? Which is power? empty. Uh -huh. That's your gray water tank. And it's your other gray water tank, right? So when are we going to press that one? If we're going to, you just, just you're just checking levels. Oh. That's all. The the I mean the the water from that black gray. The when it's full, you want to dump it. Okay, how do we know it if it's full? Like here, right? Uh, right here. Yeah, yeah it's it says so oh, okay. empty one third, two thirds full. Oh, okay. okay. Um, pumps. Is this your heater pump? Is your water pump? Like I said we're not we're, we're not hooked up to any power yet, so that's just some battery power. These will work. These will work on uh, constant power. Your battery is going to run your fridge. It's going to mm -hmm. run your lighting. It's going to run your uh, your fans. Um, when you're hooked up to constant power, then you can start doing charging. You can use the microwave. You can use the heater, heater and, and air conditioning as well. Yeah, but you said uh, the battery won't work for the microwave and uh, AC, right? Uh, microwave and AC. The battery does not work. So when we when we uh, drain the wat the water, just press this. Nope. Oh, this is automatic. That's how, you, that's how you're checking. Oh, just for oh, checking. this one is just checking. Oh, okay. So if no, this one hold, is. Hold on. I'm sorry, I was putting this key back on there for you. So this is this is turning your water pump on. Okay. Mm. And your water heater on. Oh, I see. Oh, okay. So once you're filled with water, if you want your water to run, you gotta turn your pump on. Okay, yeah. so without using the, the stop water that we have? We have yeah, anything water. in there right now is all mm -hmm. winterized fluids. Okay. So you just want to dump everything out. Any water that's in the tank, just dump it out. Before we fill Before up. you fill up and, and do it fresh. Because mm -hmm. right now, again, it's all winterized fluids. I don't want you util utilizing winterized fluids, right? Oh, okay. So anything, any liquids or anything that's currently in the system, Run okay. it out. So good thing you mentioned that. So before winter, we have to put some winterized uh, fluid. Oh, the whole thing. Yeah, the whole thing's gotta be winterized. That's correct. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, for winter time. So uh, no, there's no way to like uh, empty it, right? Empty. I mean, nothing to put it on, or just put the winterized you, fluid. And well, you're gonna it. empty it. Okay. It then... But you're still gonna have to run fluid through the system. So oh. you're, gonna, you're gonna run RV fluid through your system for your lines. So it because will... any if you if you have any water left in your lines, it'll mm -hmm. freeze and crack, right? So oh you run, yeah you yeah yeah run... makes sense yeah makes sense yeah. Okay, good, good. Um, AC unit. Once you have constant power, you're gonna have you're gonna have. There we go. That is. What is that switch? Oh, the light. Right there. Mm -hmm. Neither. Uh, so you can run your thermostat, so just set your temperature through that. Mm -hmm. Or you can just turn on your, your fan if you want to just use your fan and your heater from up there as well. Oh, okay. But it's still not working, eh? Without yeah, hooking not, it up? You got, yeah, that's not going to hit your phone out of power. Mm -hmm. uh, your fridge is going to work on battery power as well. So, just turn it on, mm -hmm. it's now working. Okay. Uh, the mode, so LP gas or auxiliary electric. Right now it's just running off of gas. Mm. And that's auxiliary. So auxiliary is gonna tell you how, what auxiliary is gonna be, it's gonna switch. Mm -hmm. So when it's not hooked up to something and you wanna use your fridge and you have it and you're not sure, you don't want to go run back and forth and switch it back and forth. When you know you're going somewhere, you're filling up your fridge, put it on that. Oh, no, so right? it's right automatic. There, and then it's automatic. Okay. okay. It switches wherever, it, whenever, if it doesn't have a battery connection, you use the propane. If it doesn't use the propane, you use the hookup. It'll always constantly use some sort of source to keep everything mm, cool. Okay. Right? Okay. And that's okay. just on and off. On and off. There you go. And then... Uh, microwave, standard, right? Yeah. yeah. Got your manual and operating manual for that as well. And this uh, one all just... your fans. 
It's just from uh, That's just cooking. gas. That's just gas. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And on the back, once your gas is all hooked up and you got your primer on, mm -hmm. just tick, 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 tick. That's it. Okay. Mm -hmm. Pretty straightforward. Lots of storage, like you said before. It doesn't have the uh, ladder from here, right? There is no ladder, no. no. Yeah. And that switch also works for this as well. Oh. Yeah. So they have their own buttons. Okay. They have their own buttons. And if I'm gonna put the bracket for TV here, how how are we gonna like, install it? it? How you would install it on any household? Oh, yeah, okay. yeah I mean. There, is there any hardwood inside there to... Yeah, that's why they have that here. That's why... Yeah. yeah, just make sure you don't use really long screws. Hmm. Yeah. Right. See, it's all hardwood here? Or... Correct. Yeah. Yeah. Just to line up because I'm, I'm planning to put a, just a 32 inches TV bracket. Yeah, if you just... You can have the swivel brackets too. Yeah, I have right, that so I have the... Yeah, because I'm wondering if it's same as a house has a... How did, how did they yeah, call that's, it? Yeah, so uh, that's why they scud? have this... That's why the backer locations here, they have a hardwood back, they have a hardwood piece in this area. Oh, just on that area? Yeah. That's correct. Yep. Okay. Yeah. So, how do we on the... How do we on the what? Yeah. The yeah. shower? Just a, just a regular shower. Yeah, once your water's on and your pump is on... Oh, both, use... both that switch needs to be on? Both switch need yeah. to be on, right? Yeah, that's well, you have to have your water on and your pump on. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Without that, nothing, no water flow. And yeah, everything works the same way as you would in your house. Okay. Have your fluids going. Fun. And how about that fun? How it that works? That fun. Uh, uh, this one. Oh my god. Yeah. What is that? Something in that bubble. The oh, it's probably spotting spl area. splatter from outside. Oh, mm -hmm. okay. Yeah. So we can open that one. Okay. Yeah, you can open it up and just turn the fan on. When you have one of those days, you know. Yeah. <laughs> you know, when you're camping, you have those days. Mm -hmm. And how this one fold? Uh, it doesn't fold. You just take it off, take off the legs, store the legs underneath here. Oh, just... Uh... More storage. Good storage under both of them. Yeah, so just oh, take... So just, uh... Yeah, you just take off the legs and it sits on there. How, how do you how, how to move? Oh, oh. Just pull it. Just pull it out. Pull out. That's it. So and then it out, take the legs off, put it underneath there, and it just literally sits on this lip here. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. So this this little lip right here. Okay. It sits right there, and then the cushions move all the way through. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. Great. Fresh water started. I think I saw something. Oh no. Oh, that one. The the over there. Oh, Which one? The switch. What's that? Uh, that is a CO2 detector. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yep. So there's nothing here. No, that's just there. That's a CO2 detector. That's a gas detector. Uh -huh. okay. It's so there's some leaks inside. Exactly. Yeah. Okay. Good. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Exactly. Um, okay. okay, and the last one is the awning. Or yeah, awning. Is this long enough to use? Or? That is just called the starter kit. Mm -hmm. So if there's any kind of hosing or anything you want to get after the fact, mm -hmm. if you want to get some longer hosing, if you want to get some different kind of hosing, depending on what kind of camping and where you're camping at, it's up to you. That's just a starter kit to get you started. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And including the uh, 30 amp cable, right? I mean, to plug in with uh, electric electricity. Yeah, the cables underneath there too for your part. Is it as well. all those uh, uh, electricity from the camping? Is it only one uh, amps, 30 amps? From where? From the campsite. Like all the campsite has 30. Same amps. amperage as if you would have yeah. Just plug that cable That's and right. to that. Oh, that thing. Just like that. Mm -hmm. So for this one here, mm -hmm. this is going to plug into your unit. Uh-huh. To your trailer. And this is going to plug into your campsite. 
Okay. But there's an adapter you can get. There's an adapter you can get that goes from here to a regular it, it, plug. To a regular plug. Yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah. Oh, this one is uh, like a converted to 30 amps, right? To the ordinary plug. Yeah. All you need is uh, just a. Uh, uh, where, where can we get that adapter? This is auto. Canadian Tire. Uh, okay. Auto. Yeah. Okay. Okay, and then how do we enter the... Yeah. Um. Cable antenna, if you're at a campsite that has... Cable. You know, if you want to hook it up to your TV, you just plug it in here and it'll come through to your cable outlet in the television. Okay. Certain sites have it, certain sites don't. Yeah. And you also, if you have your thing everything set up, you have plug outlets up here Go as outside, well. Yeah. Yep. More storage underneath here as well. Empty. Yeah. Yep, should be empty. It's empty. empty. More extra storage. The pads that we have in there uh -huh. are, the, are the pads you can put underneath your uh, jacks. This is your fresh water hookup. Fresh water here? Yeah, that's the one I showed you before. How, how can we know if it's full? It's overflowing? Yeah, if you're filling it up, you also have that thing in your tank, your button there too, you can press it. Oh, so someone oh, okay. should be watching it? Yeah. Okay. If, if it comes out and you fill it up, it's just, yeah, it's full. <laughs> yeah. There's always that too. <laughs> yeah. Right? It's only water. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yep. Okay. So that's a freshwater hookup. So campsites and RV parks and other places that supply water. And then, uh, fresh because water. there's another cable hookup here if you have on the wrong side. Okay. And this is uh, your city water connection. So if you're not at a, a campsite or an RV park filling up at a water station, mm -hmm. you just fill it up with your host. With a hose, yeah. Yeah, with a hose. Oh, okay. So this is your garden hose, net regular garden hose attachment. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's just your venting. So it's supposed to be we have a uh, extra water hose, right? For this one, just in case, or oh, campsite we have. Yeah, Well, the campsite's definitely. gonna have the hookup for that. Yeah. So, so the campsite's gonna have the, the fresh oh, water hookup. Oh, this one is just for. Uh, That's just if you're somewhere and you want to use a garden hose. Like oh, in our okay. house, in at the house. back. Oh, okay. In your I house or back. somebody's home. And that everybody, and, and they're all universal, right? They're all going to be the same. Oh, okay. Oh, so this is uh, yeah. first inlet and this is the second inlet. Right. It all goes to the same tank. tank. Yeah. Same okay. tank, just two different ways to fill it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. This is your plug-in. It's your power. Mm -hmm. Okay. Power. All right. Hey, Ryan. Yeah. Yep. Their chains are too short. They're going to need extenders. Extenders on the chains? Yeah. Oh, to hook up to the... Yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay. I'm done. Okay. Uh, ben. That's just venting for your, uh, for your oven. Mm -hmm. And more storage. This is a good tool. Oh. More storage. Okay. And where's the hose for draining the uh, septic tank? That's in the starter kit. Oh yeah, I mean, where, where should we put it? Oh, oh. other side. Yeah. Sewage, sewer, outlet. Oh, yeah. So sewer just, just plug in there. Yeah. So that's the. That's just a cover. Oh, cool. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, so when you're draining, just make sure. Oh, water in there. Mm -hmm. If you're draining, just make sure you pull black first, then gray. Right? You mean pull like this? Yeah, just pull like I just did. Okay. So black. Okay. So yeah, that one is from black. toilet, eh? Yep, and then pull your gray. Yeah, toilet first it. before the water. Yep. So it will clean. What size, what size is this? 19? Ah, 18? Yep. 17? I'll check. And then this is just your drain lines. So hot and cold water drain lines right here. If you want to drain it out. Yeah. Open it up and drain and them out. How, how can we winterize it in winter? I mean, what can we put the winterize? Uh, you can take it to a place to winterize. Oh, there's a place for that? Yeah, any place we'll winterize. There's just lots of... If, even here? Uh, yeah, we have a guy. Yeah, I can just give you... How much do you need? That I don't know. 
Okay. Uh, I'll, maybe, I'll, yeah, maybe, maybe we'll we call you. Yeah. <laughs> no worries. Yeah. No worries. This is our first time. <laughs> so, what he means by chain extension. Ah, ito pala yung equalizer. Mm. So, yan. Kinabitan kasi ng kinabitan kasi ng ano, ng ng bagong hitch kasi hindi pwede yung yung ordinary hitch na ginagamit ko. Kasi iba siya, medyo malaki. And then, nilagyan nila na ng equalizer. Itong equalizer, ang purpose nito is pagka yung nag-long drive, hindi siya yung malikot. Kukontrahin niya. Ayun o, bagting o. Alright, so, this is your all hooked up. What we're gonna do is we're gonna have you unhook it. Yeah, so that you know how. Because okay. we need to, we're not going to pull it out anyway. He's going to pull it out with the thing, but this is it all hooked up for you already. Mm -hmm. so this is going to be your your sway, anti sway. Yeah. Where can I buy now. the pad? You, I gave you pads. Um, you can also put a foot. You can buy feet for it too mm -hmm. if you want. Yep. Yeah. Uh, this one here, uh, the more, so if you're on the highway and you find there's a lot of wind blowing, you can increase the friction. Just, if you want, if, if you want I'll back it off. Just feel it. Feel so it, take your it. hand, feel it. Like this way? Not. Yeah, so just feel until there's a little bit of, feel that's already starting to get tight. That's, that little bit of tightness there already mm -hmm. is really tight. Okay, so if you're in the city and you're doing lots of turning, you don't want that. So mm -hmm. you probably leave it. If you have, you feel it snug like that, back it off like this, okay? And that's going to give you a, a little bit of tension. It won't turn by itself when it's no. moving, no? So that's going to give you a little bit of attention. Mm -hmm. If you're in the city, you're doing a lot of turning, and you find that your vehicle's having a hard time turning, it's because this is tight. Just back it off again. Back it off, okay. It, it won't, it won't back, remove, I mean, it won't. No. And if you go back on the highway, give it a little bit more tension again. Mm -hmm. And that'll keep your sway bar going. Okay. But if you have it tight in the CD and you're doing lots of turning, it's gonna, it's gonna fight it, right? Okay. okay. So there's that. It's so, just not 360. Eh? It just uh, yeah, uh, just like that. That's it. Just like that, and then all the way. Yeah, that's it. Just snug enough. Just snug, mm -hmm. not tight. Okay. Because okay, okay. if it's really tight, it's not gonna. Yeah. Okay. Unless it's really windy and you want to do that. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> um. So to take this apart. Right here, just get to alleviate some of the tension. Mm -hmm. That's it. So you're mm -hmm. taking the tension off. Mm -hmm. Okay. Pull that. Oh, no need to adjust it. Sorry. Nope. You don't have to adjust it. It'll adjust as soon as you go in there. Pull that. There we go. Get the tension off of this. Right. Pull that through. Pull your pin. Mm -hmm. And see how much each. Second. Got one link on there. Second link. Okay. Right. okay. That's it. Same to the other side. Same to the other side. Second. Second as well. Second as well, right? Yeah, same. Should both be the same. That's it. Okay. And this one is fix it. Oh, there's no way to move to yep. this one here. Those, those, those slide right up. Okay. okay. So for this, continue going on. It's going down. Oh, wrong way. Yeah. Hmm? Okay. Okay. Need another block.
wanna drive a faster car Nothing can break me, no, nothing can break me Try not to hold me down, feel alive When I'm in this town Look at those beautiful stars, I wanna take a trip to Mars Nothing can break me, no Try not to 